I am Tande Gamlaba, the main Cape's guide. I've been a guide at Jan's Castle from 2011 till today. So I like the bird because it's nice and more peaceful. And each and every time I get connected to the nature, history, and I used to get other cultures and a lot of people coming and visiting there. My name is Mshlaba Rowan Mweli. Uh, I actually grew up in this village. I was born here, I grew up here. And I work here, currently work here at Kembeck as a custodian, uh, taking visitors uh, to their site where we see the Bushman uh, rock art paintings, which has been here for approximately 4,000 years. Drakensberg is rich because we have a lot of paintings on it. So it means the soil is the home of the sand. The sand they leave there information all so they leave their information for the lots and lots of generation of them so the mountain that you have is sharp like the spears that's why you call it on zulu ukatamba i started hiking these mountains i was still a young boy uh, with my grandfather my grandfather is actually a diviner uh, some people they call them a sangoma so i used to walk these mountains uh, with him i was still a young boy collecting herbs here because as for them, as the Sangomas, they believe each and every place uh, with these Bushmen paintings, it's a spiritual place. So they come here to empower themselves, uh, themselves spiritually, to communicate with their ancestors as well. I'm coming out of the park. So it means I'm coming from 14 kilometers from Jan's castle. My grandparents, they were born there, and they think that it's happened. So Jan's castle, it's helped the community. Working here at Kembeck uh, was a great opportunity for me, especially as a young person. And I always tell people at my age that honestly, it's a pity that some of us, we don't know where we come from, yet our grandfathers are there with this knowledge. If you want to get closer to your ancestors and you want to know lots of history, it's better come to Drakensberg. <laughs>